Uh, today I'm going to be taking our tour of some apartments at University Village and at Hearts Cove in Clemson. Hello. Welcome to my house. First we have some plants, um, a nice TV, picture. We have a half bathroom. The light's right here. So we have a complete washer and dryer. And then over here, we have our table where we eat. We have a outdoor patio deck. And um, we, we relax out here a lot. And that's the train. It goes by sometimes. <laughs> so we also have great bike storage out here. Um, this is my bike, yeah, so I usually just leave it out here for easy, quick access. Sometimes we have a cat out here. Um, it's really nice. I like to think of it as my pet cat, even though it's not. Yeah. Okay, so then right here we have the fridge. Then we have a stove and oven. Lots of cabinets for storage. A dishwasher, of course. Oh, and a microwave. Right this way. We have three flights of stairs, two rooms on each floor. If you, if you see the homies with the Okay, um, welcome in. Okay, so welcome to my room. This is my desk. Over here I have a mini fridge. Uh, usually I'll just have some water in there some oranges over here. I, I hang my keys right here. And it's like a sticker wall. So I'm kind of continuing the theme from the stadium suites. I just tape the stickers there. Here I have a bamboo curtain that separates my closet from the rest of the space. If you come right in here, I have a lot of clothes. Um, also I have a birthday sign my necklace rack and my beats. A nice other feature that I have is a calendar. Um, so then right over here I have my plants. Uh, this oh. is my view. There's a pool in the distance if you can tell. Yep that's it right there. And um, I have my shoe, some of my shoes here. This is my bathroom. There's a nice window for lighting. And then I have a to a hand towel and then a shower towel. And if you come around here, I have a nice shower curtain, beach themed. Um, and yeah, just a basic shower. Yeah, so, <laughs> uh, so this is my bed. It's on the floor, but it's kind of trendy. I tried to get a bed frame, but I ordered off Amazon and never came. And then when one finally came, it was the wrong one. So I just ended up sleeping on the floor. And it's really nice because I'll just be laying down. I can look up at the stars. <laughs> then I have this that my cousin drew. She drew like a picture of a butterfly. And then obviously, you know, all of this posters. Um, another feature that I want to mention is this fan. Whenever I first moved in, um, it didn't have a fan. It was just a light and these rooms are supposed to have a fan. So I like told them and then they got me a fan. This is where I keep all my clothing, like my shorts and stuff. And then I just have some decorations. And then over here is my closet. One of the doors did fall off, but <laughs> it is still a wonderful working closet. It has sliding doors. And then I've upgraded my shoe rack this year, so it's a little more stable than it used to be. Over here <laughs> is my desk. It was very nicely built into the wall, which I really like because I did not want to go finding a desk. 
I'm gonna be honest, I never sit here. So I have this little chair, but it's not very comfortable. And then I just kind of have some decor and different things. So over here, I decided to get a floor length mirror, but I'm very tall. <laughs> so I couldn't see myself that well. So I put it on this nice little box. Highly recommend for any tall girls out there. Shout out my tall girls. So this is my bathroom. It has everything you need, a mirror, a sink, a toilet, and a shower. What more could you ask for? Really, the last big main features of my room are my bed, of course, and this is where I sleep. I also do my homework here and not at the desk, which is not good. Then I decided to hang some CDs on my wall, which took me an insanely large amount of time and do not recommend it, but it also looks cool, so maybe I do recommend it. And the last thing I really wanna highlight and my favorite thing about my room are the stars on my ceiling. Um, it is never too late to get stars on your ceiling and you should definitely invest. <laughs> Sound like I'm kidding. I've been making like 2,000 a minute. Hi, welcome to my room. Um, just like one of my favorite features is my mirror dresser combination. I DIY'd my dresser. It used to be just wood, so I fixed it up. It has four drawers, really handy. Um, this mirror is for my old house. I have a little piece of it here. And this is my shower curtain, went with a plant theme. Um, and I have two rugs in my bathroom. One is when I get out of the shower and one is when I'm just walking to my toilet. So this is my desk area. Um, this is where I spent most of my time during school because Zoom year 2020 to 2021. So this is my favorite desk chair that I've ever purchased. Uh, just a really little nice area to store my appliances. Yeah. Yeah. And then also hold my TV. And this is my bed. Um, it's a little small for me, a little, but, and I have this beautiful, beautiful view that I wake up to every morning. Um, it's a lot, it's a lot better when the trees aren't there and it's winter, but it's still very nice of the lake. And then this is my shoe organizer that hangs on the back of my door. Um, it's really helpful when I need to put my shoes somewhere and instead of putting them on the floor, they're here. And then I also have two drawers under my bed. This one's full of shoes. And then this one is full of sweatshirts. And then we also mentioned that the top of my dresser holds things such as my Quay sunglasses. Um, yeah. Yep. And my perfume and my hair ties, some jewelry, my gum. <laughs> and also a reminder that I have to see every day. Go Clemson Tigers. Hi, welcome to my room. I have a lot of plants. Um, most of them are doing well. Some of them are not. Um, this is my closet um, over here. I have this little hook, but I don't have anything to put on it. Um, this is my longboard. I painted that myself. So this is my bed. Um, I sleep here a lot. I do a lot of classes here. Um, this is my calendar. I got it from Etsy. These are my favorite wrappers right here. They give me inspiration for when I feel down. And um, this is a tiger that I got from my parents. He's missing one too. Okay, um, I also put my bed on risers, which gives me a lot of storage. Um, some of my shoes are right here. Got that little shoe rack, and then I use the shelving over here for my shoes as well. So, and then here is my bathroom. <laughs> Welcome to my room. Um, I have my closet, the Death Valley sign, and it's still pointing towards Death Valley, just farther away. Um, I still have my Clemson banner from freshman year. Got this new dresser. Um, here's my desk. I 
really like it. I like the shelving since we were online this year. Sometimes I put it up here in my computer to get some standing in for the day. <laughs> um, <laughs> these are my paintings that I bought from Italy when I studied abroad. <laughs> this is my bathroom. I especially love my shower curtain. <laughs> It's very unique. Um, <laughs> this one's my favorite. <laughs> I also have a cat on the toilet above my toilet because my mom gave it to me one year and I just really like it. So I kept it. <laughs> the best feature of my room is my bed <laughs> because it can move up. <laughs> So when I'm an old lady, this will come in handy. <laughs> Still going. <laughs> Have a good day. Every day about a woman's and I'm wary. Make sure I smile in public when I'm